imafoundation.com is a registered organization in India 2019 and in London 2008. The organization was established with the core purpose of identifying, supporting and promoting the best of contemporary Indian artistic talent and traditions in the international arena. In particular, selecting, supporting and promoting the artists deemed to be the future standard bearers for Indian art. The cultural traditions and endangered arts of India are also showcased and supported to ensure they inspire and engage a new generation. In 2017, Ima was chosen to represent India at UNESCO's World Humanities Conference held in Liège, Belgium, where the endangered arts of India and contemporary art was showcased. It used to be committed to showcasing and cultivating the cultural DNA of the Indian nation. From April 2020 till the present, imafoundation.com is offering a live online art project which is focused on offering art training for all interested during the lockdown period. Imafoundation.com is proud to present a retrospective show of the works of the artist Sunanda Sanyal. Sunanda Sanyal was born in West Bengal, India. She completed her BFA in 1989 and her MFA in 1995 in ceramics from the Gala Bhavna Shantaniketan Vishwabharati University. As an artist, Sunanda has received numerous awards. From 1989 to 91, she received a scholarship from HRD as an outstanding artist. In 91, she received three awards, the AIFACS Award, the Encoder Metro Art Gallery Award, and the prestigious Charles Wallace India Trust Scholarship from the British Council. In 98 to 2000, she received the Junior Fellowship from HRD. Between 1993 to 95, she regularly received the Merit Scholarship at the Galabhavna Vishwar Bharati University. Her artworks are in the collections, DSP, DVC, Folk and Tribal Cultural Centre, Government of West Bengal, the Metro Train Compartment in Kolkata, and many private collections in India and abroad. Sunanda Sanyal has some remarkable and varied work experiences in various places. She has worked in the commercial ceramic factory in Kolkata for two years, pottery for rural youths, and a design development program where she worked on batik and tie dye. Sunanda is really committed to undertaking social work and has formed an NGO for the rural and village women to make them more self reliant through providing different handicrafts to train. Other social work projects include the Narendra Bhav Ram Krishna Mission, Kolkata, HRD, and the Government of India project at the place of North 24 Paragonas, West Bengal, India. Sunanda has also continued to work as a freelance artist from 1989 to the present date. From her graduate days, her artistic approach has been enriched by the soothing presence of nature everywhere at Shantaniketan, and this plays a prominent role in all her work. The red soil of Koya, along with nature and Tagore's influence, has enriched her style in the process of her artistic growth. She does not choose to imitate nature, rather she is inspired by nature's various colours and forms and adds a different dimension to her work. This is clearly seen in all kinds of Sananda's works across all media, with ceramics being her favourite. She also likes to bring texture and different effects, often using handmade paper, but also using other mediums such as canvas and acrylic board. With ceramics, she started her work from earthenware, but gradually shifted her interest in stoneware using food, wood firing in her approach. During the pandemic, she has organized several educational education 
programs to support people. In particular, she has created an online platform for craftsmen to be educated and to help sell their crafts. First of all, I would like to thank the IMA Foundation for giving me the opportunity to showcase my work on this platform today. I express my respect and gratitude to my teachers, parents, and all who supported my artistic journey. Welcome as we go on a journey together of my creation. Thank you, Sunanda. Uh, we are Ima Foundation and here all of friends from our 1989, 1991 base, Kalababan, Santini Ketan. We are different, different part of the India and different, different part of the world as well. So we do every two weeks one gathering and we open a, like a retrospective. So, uh, nearly 20 to 30 years what we done. My name is Radha Binur Sarma. I am a founder of imafoundation.com. I am a painter and I do full-time work in art. Thank you. Yeah, I'm Rani Sharma. I'm the director of imafoundation.com and I support all aspects of uh, the work in particular promoting artists and showcasing artists and supporting artists. This is Terracotta Coil Pot. This is Terracotta Pot by throwing process. This is throwing process, uh, Ardenberg glass pottery, uh, stuck in rice bran. Ardenberg glass pottery. Ardenware glass pottery coil process, Ardenware pottery slab process. Um, this is um, done by Chinese ink, colored. This is also colored Chinese ink. This is also a colored Chinese ink uh, and dot. This is Chinese ink on paper. This is earthenware glass pot. Throwing process. This is throwing process, earthenware glass pot. This is um, showing process Ardenberg glass pot uh, for wood firing. Ardenberg glass pot, Ardenberg glass pot slab process uh, by using dry oxide. Terracotta sculpture pinching process. Ardenberg glass pot throwing. Uh, surface Ardenware glass pot, half glass and half terracotta. Ardenware glass pot, high temperature glass. A stoneware glass pot, half throwing, half um, cutting. A throwing pot, Ardenware glass was done by wood fairing. Uh, this is Ardenberg throwing pot. Uh, this is a realistic mural. Terracotta mural, uh, folk and terrible art. This is the stoneware sculpture. This also stoneware. Uh, this is stoneware slab process technique. This is terracotta mural use of 
a different type of place. Uh, this is terracotta mural, uh, different types of local clay uh, like red, yellow and black. This is terracotta mural. This is same architectural um, design. This is terracotta mural. This is landscape mixed media on handmade paper. This is landscape mixed media. This is also landscape mixed media. This is also landscape mixed media. This is stoneware sculpture, slab process, cutting geometric form. This is terracotta mural, um, painting process. This is stoneware sculpture. This also stoneware glaze sculpture. This is terracotta mural. A landscape mixed media on handmade paper. A landscape black and white uh, stuck Nepali paper on the painting. This is mixed media. A stoneware a glaze a sculpture, a stoneware model. This one stoneware mural. I'm going to ask you what is the stoneware? You are, you are quite interesting, people should know. Stoneware, one type of many types of ceramic body huh? like um, earthenware, stoneware, um, porcelain, uh, bone china. I just wanted to ask, when you say unglazed stoneware, then uh, how are we seeing some sort of colors? Is that engobe? Have you put engobe? Uh, not engobe. This yes. is uh, direct oxide. Direct oxide, okay. Iron oxide? Iron oxide? Or manganese? Uh, manganese, cobalt, mixed okay, iron. Right. A mixture of red clay, fire clay, uh, china clay. Mixture. <laughs> this is stoneware. Same process. This is a batik on cotton jacket, one color. This is batik, one color on cotton jacket. This is two color, batik on cotton jacket. Um, this is batik and ethnic work on silk shari. I and Jai on Tosho Shari. I and Jai uh, on Tosho Shari. This is your, this is all our um, rear color. This is done by natural color. This also natural color. This is natural color. A 
this is um, uh, Ardenware Raku Grace Potter. Sketch pen and ink on uh, Kaji's paper. This is also Kaji's paper, pen and ink. This is pen and ink on Kaji's paper. This is also pen and ink on Kaji's paper. Pen and ink on Kaji's paper. Pen and ink on Kaji's paper. Watercolor and charcoal, uh, handmade paper. This is handmade paper. This is also handmade paper. Um, uh, watercolor and charcoal. This is watercolor and charcoal on handmade paper. This is watercolor and charcoal on handmade paper. Watercolor and charcoal on handmade paper. Acrylic color and oil pastel cartridge paper. Use on cartridge paper, acrylic color and charcoal. This is watercolor an oil pastel on handmade paper. This is also acrylic color and charcoal on a cartridge paper. Uh, this one the recycled paper, mixed media. This one the recycled paper mixed media. This is also recycled paper, mixed media. Acrylic color and charcoal on canvas. Acrylic color and charcoal on acrylic board. This is Corona journey, uh, lockdown period, sketch, black and white, pencil and water to paint. All works are same process. This is batik print on silk fabric. This is batik paint, uh, fabric painting on toshol shari. Shumamna, I like your ceramic, uh, especially for all the, those uh, stoneware needles. Okay, those are really nice. And your batik work also. Uh, very nice. Thank you. Boni, I really, really like the, uh, the, the, the ceramic work because I love working with clay. And you know, those uh, various glazes you brought in, very nice. Really, really great. I really enjoyed all that. And uh, also, of course, the murals. I mean, working in clay is a magical feeling, and I really, really miss it too. So, I, I mean, I really appreciate what you've done. And also some of your uh, paintings. Thank you. Uh, I don't have some picture after firing uh, because 
um, that time i captured the um, uh, uh, photograph by slide so i cannot uh, um, show my uh, complete person we just gone through sunanda sarnal's retrospective unfortunately sunanda uh, didn't show all of work uh, because most of her work is in calcutta uh, so i spoken recently with sunanda sunanda said i can't get the all of her up so it most of work is in slide is so i'll slide to making photograph that transparent in uh, digital form uh, this little bit difficult uh, sunanda work uh, really very interesting work and aesthetically uh, arranges the all object it is uh, really appreciable and uh, mainly terracotta work are uh, really very good i like it all terracotta work and some uh, design of uh, sarees and other part so there is also be very good impression uh i think so light individual character bring with sunanda it i like very much thank you vishesh yeah sunanda i want to know the big mural that you've done so 16 by 4 feet the terracotta with the folk motifs where is that in the folk art where where is that mural actually done Uh, this is um, a four part uh, this mural is um, placed on folk and tribal center um, in the Bengal government calcutta yeah that that was very interesting aapka drawings mujhe acha laga khas kar jo early landscapes aap kiye hain mixed media bahut interesting hai and then wo apne ye jo um, स्टोन बेर पे अनग्लेस्ड किया ना वो बहुत ही इंटरेस्टिंग है क्योंकि वो पैनल्स भी बहुत अच्छा है नंदन मेला में आपका एक छोटा सा पॉट मैंने खरीदा था अभी मेरे मायके में है आपने बनाया था एक छोटा सा पॉट ऑलमोस्ट द ग्रीन दैट यू आर वेयरिंग वैसे पॉट है मेरे पास मैंने खरीदा था तब वो उस वक्त मेला में आई एंजॉयड सीइंग इट वाज गोइंग बैक टू दोस डेज नाइस thank you patiba so i like the waterfall very much and i didn't think that this type of works i have to uh, see after a lot time uh, uh, i i am very much congratulate to sunanda to show us uh, this very interesting works congratulations okay, okay. bye hello hello हेलो थैंक यू मॉर्निंग को भाला दिया सुनंदा को भाला दिया बाय 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 बाय